Welcome back to GDPG, where we play games and talk game design, and yeah. we're playing more Overland, and we're going to speed things up a little bit because, well... Because you're taking too long. I'm taking too long because I'm thinking a lot about each of my decisions. Wee-hoo! Which, Wee-hoo! I mean, it, it, at least I think that's worth talking about how, like, I thought this game I would be able to play pretty mindlessly and just be like, okay, well, I just got to choose everything carefully and blah, 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 blah. But in all reality... Oh, that's that right. I have so think. much gas. Why did I... You know what? Oh, you know what? I wanted to talk about that. In the last frame, I missed it. I wanted to mention that your people are just sitting there cuddling <laughs> with the fuel canisters next to a fire. <clears throat> just just wanted to point that it, out. It, was, it almost looked like they were like... <laughs> Gasoline, yep, you're the yep, only yep. thing that's that brings my life peace. Well, they're on. Oh, see, now they're not cuddling around the fire anymore. Well, uh, well, yeah, it's true. But bam, look at that. I dude. feel stupid though because I didn't even need to. Um, oh, I didn't even need to stop it. So I was gonna stop there and siphon gas off of the the car, and then I forgot that I had 18 units of gasoline just New hanging out. Oh man, the Pokey Oaks Ranch. So I'm gonna go ahead and fill <clears> this <throat> car up now. So this one's cool. I mean, it's basically a similar type of um, challenge as the last one. Now we have to open gates instead. Oh, all right. I can even... Here, we're going to have Allison pull him in. <laughs> and now the next person, Daryl. Go, Daryl. Go, Daryl. Yeah. yeah. Hero of the story. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh, there's so many. Ooh, oh. The sound effects are really good, though. I, I really... Very important. Like, I mean, it's a game <clears throat> that the challenge is based on sound, right? So it already seems kind of important that the sound effects would be good. But, like... You should move forward one. Oh, no, you have to go back. Don't okay, you? this guy can only move once. So what we're going to do... Can move once and attack? Um, Probably. Oh, you can drive the car oh, and then wait. have him get picked up. Oh, he is going. Oh, wait. Yeah, okay. That's what we're going to do. So we're going to drive forward. And run over Daryl. Run over Daryl. And then we're just going to boogie. Because we can do that. Simple enough. The challenges so far are relatively easy to get through once you kind of figure them out. I feel like the first time I played through a lot of them, I was like, this is... There's oh, a lot. You can shortcut to the mountains now. What? It said at the very bottom. You can, now that you've unlocked the mouse, oh, you can shortcut that. Yes. Yeah. I mean, replayability right now seems kind of like, or not replayability, like there's, you can save and come back to it and all that jazz, but like the playthroughs are generally so short that I feel like it's not super necessary. Yeah. I mean, it's. But I, I guess if you do want to just like jump straight into the mountains and just like have a hard time right off the bat. <laughs> Dude, I, hard I, mode. I wonder if um, if you start with more characters if you do that, or if it's just like, sucks to suck, you're starting with two characters that don't have any equipment. Uh, probably that one. Yeah, probably. Um, these guys right here, so they're not going to move, but they are basically bombs. Yeah, I was going to say look like they're floating landmines. Yeah. Flo floating mines. They are uh, not fun they eventually start moving that's even more fun. oh they do start moving well not these guys um a future iteration of them basically uh, okay if i remember correctly anyway okay so basically we're just gonna go ahead stockpile on gas really gas is becomes the name of the game honestly like it does seem like that was kind of the thing because if food doesn't seem to be an issue so no or water so it doesn't have, yeah. it's not a game about like, oh, it's not yes. a game about natural survival. We got an energetic, by the way, so now he has a third action. Oh, he wasn't energetic before? No, it was, he, oh, he, it was, it was locked. Oh, highlighted. Because oh, he hadn't just... been with us for more I, than a day. Yeah, he's been with us for a day. He's tired out now. Now he's energetic. Yeah. Or he just, sure. he needed to live <laughs> for another day and then he like... He had, like, yeah. he had to warm up to us before yeah. he would show us his Life true power. Living now, <laughs> I've been with you for a day. Although we did clear out this area pretty quick, I'm actually kind of happy. Get in that car. Does that consume an action? Okay, it does consume an action. Um, <coughs> mm. Oh yes. Okay, cool. So he's gonna go over there, jump in that car, 
nice energetic, energetic is such man. energetic Action economy yeah energetic uh, like that's my go-to skill whenever i find anybody yeah, like yeah. if i if i were to find a, another fourth person right now i'd be like well sorry allison <laughs> Um, okay, uh, nobody has any Only because actions. we can't get rid of Daryl. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's so many. Oh, God. Oh, you got this. Just, uh, I guess I left my med around. kit out there. Actually, you know what? I bet you I can go get it. Is Daryl hurt? No, those are his actions. Oh, Daryl is hurt. Oh, he is hurt. Well, what happened? I didn't catch that. Okay, so I go out there, and then I can move back here. No, because it's going to take two actions to get out there. Hmm. Okay, okay, I know what to do. I believe in you. You got I'm this. I'm going to do this. Go, Esteban. I'm going to grab this med kit. Yeah. I'm going to move here. Now I'm going to use Daryl to pull, pull you, you in. in. Now we're safe. And then Allison's going to turn on the car. <gasps> and boogie! So good. Action economy, man. Yeah, man. <laughs> oh, we still don't have enough to get over there. Okay, so we're going to go to the forks. Or I could replace to Tordu. All right, let's just go to the forks. Maybe we'll get a sweet car. I actually haven't seen a lot of the... I haven't seen all of the, the like, possible random cars yet. I feel like yeah, I've seen most of the seen, humans. We've only seen two. These, these guys, by the way, are working on this game like crazy. Like, they put out a new update every week, almost. That's good. That's important. Especially it's, if it, you said there's only, there's only 500 copies of this out. Yeah, they're, at least their first promo, they only sold 500 copies and, like, didn't let anyone else buy any more mm -hmm. after that. Um, I think they'll do another wave at some point. But, yeah, it's 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 actually really awesome um, that they're, like, actively working on stuff. Well, that's good. And if they ever get to the point of it being early access, like, and they allow more people to buy into it, it's pretty mm -hmm. good that they're constantly putting out those updates because... That attracts me as an early access. If oh, I yeah. see movement on the game, I'm in it. That's why I was like into the games like Nuclear Throne. They were always putting out updates. And that's, that's, that's very fair. important. Daryl's still hurt. Are you just going to let him be hurt? Oh, you have the med kit. Oh, this is You're not... You're in the car. Yeah. You're well, about that. I'm not in games. the car. <laughs> Sometimes, yes. <laughs> Uh, so what I think I'm going to do is hopefully Run into one, two. So I'm going to move this character. I'm going to move Allison here. Hopefully lure this guy that way so these two can meet up. Aggro. Oh, that did not work as planned. This is not going to be happy. Oh, this is really not going to be happy. Oh, you figured this out. We should pause real quick. Okay. Okay, we're back. Sorry about that, everybody. So we need to fix Daryl. That's what we're working on. Oh, poor Daryl. I wonder what happens if Daryl dies. If it's just like game over, <laughs> it could be. To find out. All right. So if if he moves here, this is probably the only place he can move that he's not going to be killed next turn. Can he only move one space right now? Yeah. Yeah. So then, yep. Cool. Crawl. And this is where oh, you can boy. take advantage of movement. Uh, okay, so I guess I'm just going to have to get... Oh, I don't want to break the car. Break I'm really... Car. So uh, I guess what I'm thinking is I'll get in the car with her, right? Mm -hmm. Turn on the engine, drive over here, pull him in, <laughs> and uh, hope that everything will work itself out. <laughs> you got this. You got this. Oh, boy. This is not you a happy situation. Run up to Daryl. And then use the med kit. Use oh, that med kit. I can. Well, okay. So if I do that, he's going to get injured instead. Well, Actually, no. I won't be able to use. Turn. I won't be able to use the med kit because he'll be out of action. Okay. So if you move, if like I move that, here, you'll be safe. Yes. Okay. And no, that's next a good call. Turn, you can fix him up. And get in the car. No problem. Okay. Okay. I say this now. What? Oh, that must have been how he got hurt. Oh, these guys are moving now. Okay. What just happened? Oh, God. That is... Okay, so this, I think, is new functionality, but apparently these little things injure you if you end your turn in them. I did not know that. Oh. Well. So that's a predicament. That's... Bucket. That's a super predicament. Oh, boy. Well, sorry, buddy. You're going to have to fix Daryl and... <coughs> 
Huh. Well, let's just say if you if you move Daryl back. So I'm gonna heal him. He'll get an action back. Oh, you're injured too. What is happening? Yeah, what happened there? I don't know. Oh, maybe this guy injured her. I didn't think. Oh, so they don't move, yeah, they no. I attack? I thought this was one of the guys that don't move, and he must have moved in and attacked. Oh, sneaky. Oh boy, this is still not happy times. Is well, this... that's all I can do. Oh, this guy's dead. Or no, Esteban. No, Esteban. <laughs> Get in there. Go. All right. Well. We are out of here. Daryl says, book it. Woo! And that's how you pro it. Pro. Pro. So now we can actually make it to the end of the road. <laughs> and you do. Uh, so that means that this episode's going to be a little long. But for sake of uh, ending this, Jazz, we might as well. We're right here. With seven kiss lefts. <laughs> It'll be fine. <laughs> so what is the challenge here? So now, actually, this one's not bad if we had ranged equipment, which I don't, which I kind of can. This is going to be a crapshoot. Uh, you know what, Allison, you stay in there. I think you're probably better off in there. For now. And so you have to sacrifice her for the greater good of Daryl. Yeah, pretty much. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and toss this. Wow. Yeah, they all explode. <laughs> She's like, w is everyone okay? <laughs> what just happened? Oh, man. Right now it would be really nice for her to have an extra action. Just pull him in and drive. Uh, I can't. Well, I can't because that'll be her only action is pulling him in. Pull him in. Well, okay, so if I pull him in, then they're going to attack the car. If I don't, then they're going to move toward Daryl, but not quite reach him. I think this is actually the best thing to so do. So they prioritize the person. Oh. Exactly. Oh, so now... Manipulate that all. Oh, yes, look at all those, exactly. Look at all those little buddies. So now Daryl can enter. And Allison, you're going to turn on the car. I don't know why we turned off the car, but we're going to get out of here. Drive, drive through the fire. The fire. And to be to continued. Be continued. <laughs> so that's all they have for the alpha right now. Um, but if so, definitely I would say subscribe to these the uh, Finji fin, fin, F I N J I. Yeah, subscribe to their newsletter because seriously, the next wave that they're gonna uh, uh, release of like the next five hundred like copies you can buy of this game, jump on this because this is awesome. It's it's even awesome to watch this game kind of grow and develop. Yeah, it's pretty um, cool. On a weekly basis. They're working like crazy. No, and that's that's good. Constant developments, man. Um I feel but part of it. This is this this was a blast. I mean I know this is only a little like four episode series that we just did but i i really hope that you guys enjoyed this so that we can come back and play it yeah. during like maybe the beta or during other alpha builds maybe depending on how much crazy stuff goes on but uh yeah. check the link below we'll do all the stuff for you know overland <laughs> you can check it out uh but also vote for us like the things above us for what you want to see next whether it's another run of overland or if it's another game yeah and uh question of the day <laughs> I don't know. Your, um, your turn. I, I guess let's keep this one a little bit general and say kind of like, what are your thoughts about Overland in general, right? Um, ooh, I guess all things considered across the four episodes, it was kind of a very like narrow picture of the game in its whole because it, it relies a lot on random generation, right? And you're um, usually only going to get a taste when you do mm -hmm. one run through. Which, I mean, I, <clears throat> so I guess... A discussion point is is that I think they did a spectacular job setting it up to allow a lot of diversity in the randomization, both between the environments, the the level layouts, the types of obstacles in each of the levels, the types of monsters, abilities and traits that characters can have, yeah. abilities or traits that vehicles can have, even types of equipment you can loot. Like there's a lot of stuff 
they can all have random generation in it this. It gave you enough for a taste of the possibilities out there, because there could be a lot more equipment. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. There and, and, could be a lot more abilities and characters and stuff like that, and we got a taste of it. It's pretty good. Yeah. So I guess, what, what do you guys hope to see from Overland in the next builds to come? Yeah. What yeah. do you <laughs> Well, thank you for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this series. Be sure to vote, and we will see you in the comment section. Goodbye. Bye.